morning everybody welcome here back to my channel my name is Carly if you are new I thought today would be really fun to take you guys through another what I eat in a day I love these videos these are kind of like my not guilty pleasure because they're not really guilty but I just really love them on YouTube they're one of my favorite things to watch and get like inspiration on and I just really love it so I thought I'd share that today just because it's the perfect opportunity to share what I'm eating while I'm at home um, hopefully give some ideas maybe to you guys as well I will say I don't have any um, like dietary restrictions I definitely practice like intuitive eating whatever my body like needs or is wanting I kind of feed that um but in like moderation like of course I always want the Cheetos but I try not to always eat the Cheetos and that thing but um for today my goal is to have some sort of like fruit and vegetable I think I talked about this in my last vlog but have like a fruit and vegetable with every meal just because it's so hard when you're at home. You can totally like not do that sort of stuff. And I'm used to like, I was very fortunate at my job to have um, breakfast and lunch there for us. And it was always like, oh, hi. It was always just like very healthy and proportioned out well. And I'm going to miss that while I'm here. I was sitting on the floor, but I'm going to miss that while I'm here at home. So I thought I would just kind of give myself that challenge and yeah, just film what I'm eating today. So it is 8.30 now. I started work at 7. Um, if you're new here, I work on a social media team and um, yeah, love that. Working from home right now and excuse me, my bun's a little crazy. Um, but yeah, that's what I do 7 to 3.30 Monday through Friday, which I do love it. Um, and so yeah, today's kind of the first real day of working from home. We do have the option to work from home. Um, throughout the months as well but it's kind of just like once a week or you know all of we have like a limited amount to make sure that we are in office as well but so today just feels like I'm taking like a normal work from day home <laughs> work, from day, <laughs> work from home day but it doesn't feel like it's because of everything that's going on in the virus and all of that so I'm sure it's going to get a little bit weird um, not seeing my team and not going out, but I showered. I got ready. I kind of got ready. It's just like a loungy outfit. I didn't put any makeup on, but I showered. My hair's up. I feel like normal and in like normal clothes. Um, so yeah, I'm feeling good. I have my water here. That's what I meant to say when I turned on the camera. Um, it's 8.30 now. I started at 7. Haven't eaten anything. I've just been drinking my water. I love to do this in the morning just to hydrate myself after sleeping or whatever. I'm always like pretty thirsty when I wake up so I just try to like drink as much as I can but I'm actually going to go downstairs and get some coffee and this is my breakfast <laughs> sessions like very on this intermittent fasting which I think is great but it's just not something that I honestly don't have a problem eating at 10 30 and we stopped eating last night probably at like 7 um which was good because I really wasn't hung it's like I'm doing it because I'm really not hungry but when you tell me I can't have coffee or this or that that's when it doesn't get fun and that's when life and intermittent fasting seems not worth it and I don't know so I'm fine with having my coffee <laughs> is that bad I don't know let's do this Now this is my favorite stuff in the whole wide world. If you've been watching me for a while, you've seen this like every like spring and summer, this starts to come back into my life just because I don't know why I cannot make like yummy cold brew at my house. It just never tastes good. And so I saw this at the store one day when Sebastian hurt his back and I was like, we're gonna have a crazy tough weekend. Let me just get this. And then now I like can't get off of it. It's so bizarre. This is sometimes how you feel drugs would be <laughs> if I ever took drugs. Um, because you're just like, I'm gonna do it one more time. And then before you know it, you're buying like another carton. But anyway, this is my favorite, the Starbucks vanilla latte. Yes, it has sugar. Yes, it has a lot of calories, but I don't know. Sometimes things are just worth it. And I'd rather, I'm only gonna get one more. Okay? <laughs> and I put my little straw in it and then you're so good to go. Like this sets me up for the best day. Seriously. I'm gonna have this. I actually have a meeting coming up at nine. So 
I just with the timeline of my day I probably won't have breakfast until after that meeting and I'm thinking about doing um, I hard boiled some eggs so I'll show you guys this later when I decide but I think I'm gonna do that my coffee is delicious and I'm ready to go I'm gonna go work um, and yeah we'll see you back here when I decide to eat something dang it I almost forgot <laughs> my vitamins I've been doing pretty good on these little vitamins so I'm gonna take two of these these are just from Costco um, you can't really see them but yeah they're they're just like the women's vitamins from Costco I kind of got these on a whim not really doing like research or anything I like them but I kind of want to look into some other vitamins I've been looking at ritual I don't know let me know your thoughts but yeah I'm gonna take two of these while I remember okay so I finished my coffee pretty much it kind of takes me a while to finish this it is no you're okay babe it is almost 10 o'clock and so I thought I kind of like to I've been I've kind of been liking doing like two breakfasts is kind of what I was saying like I love to do like something like eggs at first and then I've been really loving oatmeal and like strawberries so I decided I would make my little eggs first so I did like a big batch of hard-boiled eggs yesterday or the day before I can't remember but I love them so I kind of everything kind of falls on the plate but I have a tiny bit of salt some pepper everything but the bagel seasoning which has salt in it which is why I only do a tiny little bit and then red pepper flakes and it's so good and then I added a little bit of grapes on the side I get over grapes so fast so i only did a little bunch but yeah this will be kind of like my first breakfast and then because these do keep me super full um and yeah i just get full really fast off of these so that's why i kind of like to split it up but it's not like a huge breakfast so that's why in a little bit i'll have my oatmeal so that's kind of what i do so i'm gonna continue working and eat this and yeah i'm excited it is almost uh 10 40 so i finished my eggs they're very good i didn't finish my grapes i have two left i don't know why i just like do not like grapes <laughs> um, i'm gonna finish those but i started to get hungry for my oatmeal so this is my little bowl of oatmeal they are just seal cut oats from trader joe's and they have like a little bit of maple sugar in them um maple sugar that's not it <laughs> maple and brown sugar in it and i just cut up a little bit of strawberries to put it in there so this will keep me full until lunch so i kind of love doing kind of like a salty breakfast at first and then a sweet i don't know it's just like my favorite thing so just thought i'd show you guys this is kind of my second breakfast As you can see it is smoothie time for sure so it is 12 o'clock and I'm feeling a little bit like I'm needing something to get me through some stuff I'm doing but not like enough to kind of make a full meal or make lunch right now so I thought I'd make us a smoothie um Sebastian's here with me as well of course but I don't really make smoothies all that often um we used to go through them like way more we used to be better at making them and yeah we just got out of the habit and i don't really make them a ton so i thought today i'd pull out some of my freezer stuff or someone hit my door um pull out some of my freezer things and make us a smoothie so this is what i've got going on um i really love to make my smoothies with coconut water i don't love like um almond based smoothies or milk based smoothies but i really do love the coconut water so i kind of like to do that and then half just like regular water but then i thought i would add a tiny bit of this um this like kefir stuff um it's supposed to be like a really good probiotic but i don't really know if that's gonna mix well i don't see why not so i might just do a little bit of that um today i pulled out spinach i also have frozen kale that i like to use but today i just use spinach i have this three berry blend from Costco that we're still working through. So I thought I'd use that. And then I love to use chia seeds. And then I'm going to pop in a little bit of the vital proteins, the collagen peptide. So I like to do um, this towards like the end. Like once I've already um, blended it up, I'll put this in here just so it mixes perfectly. But anyway, I'll show you guys that later. But yeah, that is what I'm going to put in this video.
So now that everything has had this like first little mix, now I'll put in the collagen peptides. I was watching someone on YouTube and they do this um, just so that it doesn't all end up on like the side of the cup. Cause if you do it when everything else is still like frozen, it can do that. So I just add two scoops and then it will blend together beautifully. And there are our little smoothies. So I'm gonna give one to Sebastian. I think I'm gonna have a little bit of hummus and crackers on the side because now that I'm drinking something, I'm like, ooh, now I kinda want a snack. So my pretzels are upstairs from when I was eating them yesterday. But um, the hummus that I, oh, where is it? But the hummus that I love to use is this, is just this Sabra. It's the roasted pine nut. That's one of my favorites. So I'm gonna have that with um, some of my, chopped up cucumbers i'm almost done so i'll probably just have like these five in here and my little pretzels and then that's gonna be my little snack station until later on today when we have some lunch also forgot to mention that i have a little bit left of my first water bottle for the day so i'm just gonna fill it up now um so yeah i try to fill it up a couple times a day i want to shoot for three but we'll see how i get on with the second one but it kind of did take me a while from seven to like 12 to finish this one so i'm not doing the best um but yeah hopefully by dinner i'm filling it up again that'll be right Sebastian and i just finished a quick run and a ab workout here very important and very nice to still get out of the house and look at that little baby she's in our backyard she is? <laughs> yeah our little neighbor baby um to get outside of the house and still move your body and go on a walk or do whatever um so now i'm gonna make a snack because we're gonna do something for dinner. I think I'm gonna do um, one of these yogurts. They're just the vanilla kind, it's so good. Um, I think I might just do that. And I know you guys might be overseeing these, but I love my cucumbers. Oh, especially doing push-ups. Or I, I think I actually might do some of my carrots. Sorry, I couldn't think of it. Hey everyone, it is a couple days later. It's actually Wednesday night and on Monday night I didn't end up filming what we ate for dinner. I can't remember why. What did we have? Something, uh, yeah, something not <laughs> worth sharing. Um, but yeah, it's Wednesday. We have had the craziest day. No, it was a mistake. Oh, a steak. It was pretty good, but it just was like not really anything. Um, I guess I just forgot that I was filming, but we've had the craziest day. You will see the vlog um, after this. Um, sometime, but we had an earthquake today, a very big one for Utah. It was like our second biggest one in history. It's the biggest one since 1967. Yeah, there we go. Thank you. 6792. I saw 1992. 1992? Yeah. I don't know. We'll get our sources straight. Um, anyway, it was like it was a big earthquake early this morning, and we've just been trying to kind of like chill out a little bit and. Uh, take it easy today rest up. We did just do a workout, which was nice to kind of just like Fuel our bodies get our brains active and happy at, after it's such a crazy day But we're still at home and we're cooking up some dinner So I thought I would show you because my man is cooking for me tonight and he has been like Owning the kitchen except watching you cut those mushrooms is stressing me out um, So we are making a mushroom and sausage um, and spinach spaghetti. So, uh, I'm very excited. I cannot wait. So we got Sebastian chopping up. You're in your underwear. Well, don't show me. <laughs> Anything I can help with? <clears throat> no, just uh, get this the pasta ready. I need to get out of my space. <laughs> Having like such a chill night, I told Sebastian this is like the calmest I've felt all day and it's just so fun to be able to like, <laughs> he's giving me a silly face. <laughs> um, it, it's just been nice to just like slow down a little bit tonight and make some yummy food. We want to sit on the couch, have a good movie night or something. 
so yeah it's just been a, a good end to a, a crazy day so i'm very thankful for that and thankful everyone's okay my family's okay my friends are good so excited to eat so i forgot to get it before i piled on my mozzarella chunks but underneath oh where's my fork um underneath we just have the pasta the sausage a little bit of spinach tomato mushroom onion and yeah we are going to eat this and then i think i'm gonna have a little bit of dessert so i'll follow up with you guys later on tonight when i have my nightly bowl of cereal because i love it we're still watching our episode of ozark before we go to bed but the time has come I'm gonna have some Frosted Flakes to finish out the day. And I'm also just going to sign off here. I hope that you guys enjoyed following along with me of what I eat um, in a couple days. I guess I broke this up in a couple of days, but um, yeah, it changes all the time. So hopefully this gave you some great ideas as all of you are staying home and trying to eat more at home and cook your meals. Um, me and Special had so much fun <laughs> making dinner tonight. So I encourage you to do that during this time. And yeah, I'm just thinking of you all. Hope you're all doing well and are staying safe and I will see you in my next one. Bye.